Why do people race? You really want to know why I race? Pick up chicks. Chicks take race car drivers. Covered in mud, grease, sliding around, slippy and slimy. I love it. Because I don't really do anything else. I don't hunt or fish or... I don't do anything. This is all I've done since I was a little kid. And it's all I know how to do. And I guess that's all I want to do because I never tried anything else because I don't have time. Well, my grandparents were very involved in racing back when uh, Williams Grove had the bug cars. We used to take my dad when he was a little boy to Williams Grove and all over the place. San Antonio got half field all in tracks back in the day. And we were just always something we always did every weekend for our whole lives. So, uh, go kart racing when I was nine, and from then on, we've been at the racetrack every weekend. I like the speed, I like the uh, excitement of it, and it's an addiction, and you can't stop. I've tried, I've tried different types of racing, drag racing, everything, but sprint cars, I just, uh, just can't stop. Because I used to go to the track when I was little, um, with my daddy on the track in New Egypt. So uh, I was like four, started racing, liked it. Watched my dad race on Saturday nights, so I thought it was pretty cool. So that's what I do. Well, I race because uh, it keeps me busy, and uh, it's just a whole group uh, event that keeps everyone together. And it's pretty neat to just see everyone working as a team together. I race because I have a lot of good opportunities. I like to do what I do in a race car, and I meet a lot of really great friends doing it. You know, it's always just a good time being at the track with all my friends, and uh, you know, just to go out there and beat the doors off some people at the racetrack and laugh about it afterwards. That's what it all means to me. Honestly, uh, the biggest reason why I race is we had a little extra money laying around, and couldn't figure out anything else to do with it. So I figured I'd go race, and before we knew it, I took care of that problem. I don't have any money left. As a kid growing up, I helped my dad on his cars, and that's all I really know how to do on the weekends. That's all we did was go racing, so I kind of followed his footsteps, got involved, and I'm fortunate enough to do it now and uh, be good at it, enjoy it. Uh, I don't know, just been around it forever, and um, just kind of what we grew up on. We were at great fairgrounds every weekend, and uh, just growing up, and just kind of stuck with it for years and years. Um, I think it's more a competition thing, and it all started back in uh, back back at the Ready Fairgrounds when I was a fan, and uh, kind of we were family friends with uh, the Von Dorn family, and they started racing, and uh, Craig became a little successful, and we were always very competitive in school. We were on the same basketball team, and uh, Craig would always have more points than I, so it became a competitive thing already back then. And uh, Craig was racing; I got my first race car, and continued from there. Um, became a family thing. Um, started with my grandfather building the first shop at the farm and then just continuing and, and today it's uh, all my family still here, brothers, sisters, they all tend. So um, I like the competition but the competition aspect is changing in this sport and uh, it's really hard to compete with the dollars and everything and uh, the time it takes and I just got fortunate to have a decent family that wants to put in the time to keep doing it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, give my videos a thumbs up, and you'll get all the latest. Thanks for watching, guys.